Hello guys. Yeah, I hope you're good. Yeah, so tuko area ya Kitisuru, My Gym Fitness. Yeah, eh, na manze leo nimepata pleasure ya kufanya interview na Mary. Mary is the owner wa My Gym Fitness. So leo naweza taka tujue eh, challenges zenye amepitia kama gym owner. Yeah, eh, kwa nini ali decide kuita gym My Gym? Yeah, eh, some of the services zenye wana offer hapa. What makes My Gym Fitness different from other gyms? Yeah. Eh na tuambie kwa nini watu wanakuwa kuja hapa na si any other gym. Yeah. So Mary karibu sana kwa keep fit with Nico. Asante sana Nico and yeah. hi everyone. Yeah. Karibu sana. Kabisa. My name is Mary. Um let me just say I'm a fitness enthusiast. Yeah. This started as a passion. Yeah. Uh when you tunaikanga calendar for things to do for me I have a fitness calendar ah, nice. which I've had like for the last three years. Yeah. And it's been progressive and I've seen and I've seen the impact. Yeah. Yes. Nice. So uh when we got the opportunity opportunity to now do this as a business it was a no brainer yeah yeah the location and just to bring together people to have this impact that I've experienced at a personal level yeah i think that is everything ah nice so how how long have you guys been operating for so we just turned one year yesterday ah, first nice, of march nice, nice. uh we launched it first of march last year yeah and it's it's been amazing it's been a learning curve yeah. and just hearing a client come and say nalala vizuri yeah. you know i can take my dog out without a lot of pressure yeah. i mean see him me i mean that one is just amazing yeah. fulfillment yeah. yeah now why my gym mary my why gym. why did you choose I my, love my gym yes. fitness my gym yeah ukusema tu my you already own it exactly so for us when we talk about my gym yeah. we want everyone to own their journey because it's a personal journey so ukisema naenda wapi naenda my gym yeah. you know it clicks something Quilly. in terms of ownership yeah. so it's the aspect of owning your journey yeah. and then you work together because nice. your path is different mine is different but the thing is let's do this yeah. let's own the journey and that's why my gym ah, for the nice, aspect nice. of owning the journey nice nice yeah. nice yeah. Uh, i would like to know about the location maybe some of the challenges in ipata before but the location because it's a very strategic location oh, yeah uh, for the guys when you wanna walk kama mnaishi around kitusuru gym iko petrol station hapa inaitwa total total petrol station i think this is the the third floor or the second floor second floor yeah, yeah. second floor Yeah, yeah the second floor so it's a very strategic location so ningependa kujua Mary did you right. face like any challenges in kitafka space yes. let me say for sure yeah. there was quite um a lot of challenges because uh first of all when it comes to a facility that you want to set up a gym you need a big space very true. and to get a big space is not an easy thing to get true and also the location because uh people want convenience yeah So we got other spaces where we had to do a lot of restructuring yeah. like building a lot but when we got here we felt it was ideal because of the location yeah. the convenience guys you have free parking safe and free that is rare to get Very so true. here it's just next to the road and we have free and safe parking yeah. and uh the convenience of the time we operate we open at 5 and close at 9 Monday to Saturday I mean Monday to Friday yeah. and then Saturday we open at 6 to 8 p.m. Ah nice. So we try and accommodate the different schedule by extending our operating hours. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe about the equipment Did you uh, source them from outside ama mlizipata right. locally. Wow, that was also another experience yeah. because uh we really looked for different sources. Uh to begin with we sourced uh locally yeah. but from the experience we've had we want to get them directly yeah. to import yeah i mean to import for ourselves because um the margins are crazy and the yeah. thing is it's a learning curve you learn Very you true. learn along the way yeah. uh but what i would encourage anyone who is looking to open a gym if you're able to get the things yourself yeah. i think that will be more ideal yeah yeah ah nice one so i've also seen your staff who have branded merchandise yeah maybe you can tell us more about that you guys right. like do you sell amatunia the trainers right. and the staff around my feet my gym fitness yes so this is uh, an opportunity rather a gap that we saw yeah. where people come in as they are and we encourage you to come as you are delighted yeah. to yeah kuja our slogan is jiamini kabisa uh, the thing is you own your journey believe in yourself and then you work together yeah. so as you come as you are we have the merchandise uh, we can give you we have the t-shirts we have ah, the nice. pants we have We are looking to also add the shoes and all, and everything so that you have a full attire. Yeah. We started the spin classes so we are looking at the spin bike yeah. um shorts. Yeah. So yeah, we have 
things for you. Just come as you are. We even have the towel. Yeah. Yeah. So just gillette so, too. Just Jamini, gillette. Then take we the first step. Step. together. Where could you to come yeah. to Fike? Any question on ever Kuanayo? Yeah. These guys work on a very friendly stuff. Yeah. Eh, manze. Kitu yemeni bamba sana, Mary, about this gym. Yo. Your sense your community. Yeah. yeah eh, you can tell like how watu wako na hiyo. Ni kama family. Na hii ni kitu inakuanga very rare kuipata kwa most gyms. In as much as it's about business. Kuna hiyo pia mali unataka at least. Mali unaeza enda unaongia na mtu. Kama uko na swali. Ya pia hiyo encouragement. Unajua gyms hii raisi. Oh, yeah. 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 Sure. Eh, it takes it's not. it's not easy. Inataka hiyo yeah. consistency, hiyo determination. And sometimes in a kwangu. Sometimes you, sure. you feel yeah. like you want to quit. Oh yeah. Yeah. So I feel actually, like what you wanna. Come in here yeah. And actually tell us, maybe I'm not. I'm not coming back. Yeah. Because they feel like at times they don't have the progress that they are looking at. Yeah. So what we try to do is we we do an assessment. Ah, nice. It's also mental. Yeah. So you have to kind of manage the expectation. Yeah. Like where is it going? I want to look like you in two weeks. Very I mean, true. Very true. Uh, we have to get to start somewhere yeah. and kind of mark the expectation. Yeah, we have so, to be realistic. Yeah, we have to be realistic. So yeah. what we try and do is share as much information as we can yeah. because. At times, it's the lack of information that, you know, make people stop along the way. Yeah. So we try and empower in terms of information so that you start informed. Yeah. Uh, Ukianza, you know that this is a journey that, you know, it's a lifestyle transformation. Very true. And for transformation to happen, I mean, you have to be so consistent. Yeah. And it takes discipline. And we have a good team. We have really great trainers. Yeah. And as I said, it's a mental transformation as well, not yeah. just physical. Yeah. So we start by engaging and trying to inform as much as we can. Yeah. So that to Kianza, we start informed. Kabisa. And that will help us work yeah. uh, in a consistent ni, way. Yeah. Ni, yeah. Ni lifestyle. It's not a destination. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. It's a journey, man. You said it. Yeah. 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 And, the, and then another interesting thing, Marini, most Jimonas, they don't work out. Like they are just in there for the for the money, like it's just a business, yeah. But for you, Najwa Mesema, it's a passion. But now, Namanze uko involved. Mwili pia iko fiti. Now, now, na changa mkapale. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah right, manze. Right. So, it's something encouraging sana. Yeah. yeah in as yeah. much as maybe unaiza taka. Like, ni poa kuwa good example. Unaonyesha yeah, watu yeah. like ini kitu yenye. Mm. You personally, una take serious. Yeah. Eh, na pia client wakiona hivo. I yeah. think pia Najwa, like, wala watu wana operate now. Yeah. Ni watu, like, wana min... Like, we're interested in the transformation. That's true. Yeah, so that's very interesting, Mary. So, yeah. you also told me, like, you are looking into outdoor, maybe, activities. Oh, yeah, yeah, maybe yeah. you can tell us more about that. Right. Um, just to kind of re-emphasize on what you said, yeah. uh, to be involved. Yeah. Uh, for us, it started as a passion. Yeah. Um, it's, it's something that we worked on and we've seen the impact. Like, even being quick in terms of what you're doing you get some clarity in terms of your thinking process sure. yeah and also um you get the community uh because you start the journey yourself but along the way you realize ah yeah this very is true. something actually people are interested in very true so i think don't look for people just start the journey come join us we work together yeah and um i guarantee you it's it's worth yeah. the, the start nice yeah Nice. Yeah. Yeah. So maybe in terms people, of the community, yeah. uh, sorry, uh, let me talk about that. It's okay. Uh, we realize that people are not coming here to just inua na kutoka. Really? I mean, there is a need for community. There is a need for engagement. Yeah. And we guarantee you that uh, with our outdoor activities, you'll be able to, like, you know, engage people, get customers for your business. Yeah. It's not just about. Um, coming and working, working out. out. Also networking. It's networking. Very true. Um, let me just talk about an outdoor that we had that really yeah. was a light bulb moment. Yeah. We scheduled for like um, 8 to 12 mid midday yeah. and we went all the way to 7 and nobody was like, your time. Yeah. So it's, it's Guys something just that... Having a yeah, 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 yeah. So it's, it's a need yeah. and uh, we need to keep having more of those engagements so yeah. that it's not just the fitness, it's also the networking. Ah, nice. Yeah. Thank you so much, Mary. You are doing an amazing job. Thank you. You have a very nice gym. Yeah. Uh, so to anyone, Mwenyaneza Kwa Anaishi, Kitu Suru, yeah, make sure you visit My Gym Fitness, located at Total Petrol Station. Yeah. Just come and inquire. Yeah. Hata kama unaogopa, maybe you want to experience buyer before ulienda uka train, uka uchungu sana. Yeah. Uh, just visit to tell your story in regards to nutrition, training, yeah. Uh, Iso outdoor watakuwa nafanya from time to time. 
yeah so just take the first step yeah and start your fitness journey yeah so maybe okay. do you have anything else and you want to add uh, thank you um i think just to reemphasize on the aspect of come as you are yeah. um it doesn't matter the experiences you've had before yeah. we offer complimentary sessions yeah. one or two complimentary sessions where you're able to engage our coaches uh you know get to experience the equipment that we have yeah. but as i say it's more of the experience yeah. like it's the experience you've had here so if you feel like it's so much of a risk we give complimentary come have the experience yeah. just before you commit and we guarantee you come not many people yeah. um come for the second they just come for the first and they commit yeah so we guarantee you the best experience nice karibuni yeah. to jiamini Kabisa. and let's do this kabisa umesikia yeah. form ni kujiamini kabisa. thank you so much for your time guys i'll see you on the next one cheers cheers on the floor guys yeah. nice one nice Bye. one hello guys i hope mko fit yeah so leo niko my gym fitness iko area ya kitisuru total petrol station yeah it's a very nice gym yeah na niko na hamstone hapa hamstone ni trainer hapa yeah eh, so kama unaishi environment ya kitisuru make sure umetembea eh, my gym fitness eh, wana offer services mob hamstone atakwambia more about that but the charges ni 800 per day na 6k monthly yeah eh, so kama unaishi around ama unafanya job around make sure umetembea na naweza ku guarantee jani yako ya fitness itashughulikiwa sana. So Hemston, yes. Karibu sana bro kwa Keep Fit with Nico. Thank you Nico. Yeah, so mwanzo unaweza kuambia majina zako za ID yeah. na kuambia <laughs> bro unafanya anga shughuli gani hapa? Yeah. Na kwa nini bro ni decide kufanya kazi kwa IG? Unajua kuna gyms mingi bro. Kwa nini my gym? Sa. Yeah. So hello guys. Mimi naitwa Hemston. Yeah. Eh wameniambia ni sema jina za ID. Sema jina za ID bro. Hemston Omsula. Yeah. Bado najulikana kama Hemston kweli. In short wa clans they call me Hems. Yeah. So that is uh noises bro zenye like ile shughuli unapiganga hapa okay eh, mimi nimekupata ukipiga spin nyingine hapa maji yeah. msi anaitwa the spin master huyo boy ni mnaoma yeah. sana ikifika hizo classes za spin yeah. but maybe unaweza tuambia kuna vitu vingine wewe unafanya ama umespecialize your area spin so uh, uh, on classes i do spinning yeah and uh, making sure yeah that from zao za ku lift weights ziko sawa yeah. and training them on their fitness journey yeah. to make sure that uh, they are training their fitness goals yeah Yeah, so mnao fa pia mpaka hizo personal training sana. Eh tuna fa kile ile one on one. One on one yeah. tunapo PTs, yeah. one on one. Yeah. yeah. so clients wa Kija we tell them what to do. Yeah. Well, first we tunakuangalia unataka nini your yeah. interest mode matters a lot. Yeah. Your interest mode ah, nice. on what you want to do yeah. concerning your body. Ah nice. Yes. Yeah. So umesikia wanafanya assessment ha. whether unataka kukuwa bodybuilder, you want to be strong, unataka hiyo aspect ya fitness tu. Yeah, sure. Maybe tu unataka kulala poa, yeah. Mm. Eh manze my gym ndio place unafa unatembea. Kabisa. So Hamstone, tuambie yes. manze history yote inaanzia wapi? Kwa nini bro? Kwa nini si daktari? Kwa nini huko <laughs> ama? Kwa nini si? Kwa nini uliamua bro kuwe trainer? <laughs> eh? Na imekutek how long bro kwa hiyo jani yako before leo manze uwe trainer? So for me uh, taking this fitness as a career, yeah. it's now five years. Ah, nice. So but before yeah. I was just training yeah. training yeah. so like training majwezo so home training yeah. from high school yeah. we train kwa and uh, umekuwa kwa rugby yeah. those ones yeah. and um, so nikaamua hey, this training so acha nipeleke to another level yeah. so I decided to take it as a career yeah. so it came my career from that one yeah. so bado napanda pole pole majwe inaanzia pahali yeah. so as you move forward you move forward na mimi hey, bibi manzee unaweza kuambia mm. the challenges zenye umepitia bro kama kama trainer unajua kuna mtu pia anaweza kucheka anaweza kuwa na kucheki hapo nje mm. na maybe anaweza ataka kuwa trainer mm. ama anaweza ataka ku understand more about the field ni challenges gani bro zenye unapatana nazo ukiwa trainer okay the challenge number one as a trainer yeah. you know as a trainer uh, tumesema one of our clients amesema that uh, 80% is your diet Kwele. and 20% is about training yeah. so being a trainer you need to to work on your diet also yeah so 80% meaning your diet you need to be yeah. at least ukuwe poa manzee unakula fit unakula fit uweze kuona piga machi poa makeki uweze kuona piga machi wewe ndo uko hapa unaambia uh, watu wati waishi healthy and, lifestyle and health is expensive you know very true, health is expensive very, very so kupata ile food yeah. lazima as a trainer yeah. work hard manze Kweli. and ku work hard yeah. si lazima ukuwe na job Kweli. so kupata ile job but times unapata hii unapata hii yeah. but yeah. high work venye unataka so Kweli. training yeah. becomes so hard yeah. 
So ukitrain lazima your dad pia unaangalia kweli. So like unaenda kukimbia ni yeah. nini and those you, you take your runnings morning runnings yeah. and um, yani in short yeah. bro lazima <laughs> kama wewe ni trainer lazima uko unaka kaka trainer <laughs> <laughs> lazima uko unaka eh, uwezi kuwa ti wewe ni mnono na wewe ndio unataka kuambia mtu vile <laughs> atu wait awezi ama vile ataishi a healthy lifestyle uh, so, yeah. but mzito wewe unaona mzito hapa kwa in shape yeah, yeah. Sure. Eh, na pia mtaona clips zake pale amepiga class moja amazing sana ya spin yeah, yeah. bro you ni very impressive hiyo uh, nimepiga piga lap but uh, si wasi wengi wanaweza fanya hiyo shughuli yeye yeah. yeah. unafanya yeah. Uh, then another thing na story ya, ya diet tunapatanga pia most clients i think awana ile discipline ya kumaintain hiyo ni ya ya diet sijui kwa umepatana na hiyo unajua bro unaweza train mtu hard mm. lakini sasa akikula vibaya eh. anarudi kwako kama trainer anakuambia <laughs> hii training tunafanya ifanye kazi so unakuwa disappointed kabisa yeah. as a trainer you be disappointed yeah. sasa so, una dilaje na hiyo bro you ni client mm. of course anahitaji services zako unahitaji labda do yake mm. umemtrain umemtrain to the best of your ability mm. but sasa ana ile discipline ya kukula poa So for you as a trainer bro kitu kama hiyo una handleaje unakuwa frustrated ama what do you do bro So as uh, most of the time as a trainer you yeah. become frustrated yeah. because you number one <laughs> unajua uwezi fata mtu mkubwa kule home yeah. uko home ujue uwezi then you can't just be calling anytime yeah. anytime kwa hiyo mtu ako na yeah. familia yeah. you call saa 3 leo unamwambia umeish nini eh, umekuna nini manzi eh, you can't follow up so yeah. as a trainer so akija hapa you just try to unamwangalia yeah. unamwangalia daily by day yeah. so he discover that uh, there's no change yeah. then hapo from from hapo yeah. then ndio utaanza kuchukua the next step Kweli. ya ku yeah. ya at least kumwongelesha tu kumwongelesha kumwe encourage yeah, kumwe encourage hii naweza hii naweza hii naweza yeah. so yeah hapo from that ataanza ku pick pole pole ku pick pole pole ni kweli yeah, yeah. then unajua bado huwa tunasema in as much as tunasema fitness ni lifestyle mm nafaa tunakumbuka bro it's easy for us cuz hii ni kitu tuko passionate about yeah sure but to some guys unapata mtu anafanya tu juu anataka help yake ikuwe fit yeah. but si ati ana enjoy hiyo kuumia unajua for me and you bro tunaweza kuwa na enjoy ku workout kabisa na hii ni kitu kingine yenye pia naona anga trainers wengi hawa yeah. understand but bro ni mwanawe ni mse social yani uko poa yeah. uko na vibe flani yeah. unacheka na wase ni mwanawe yeah. pia vile una interact na ma client yes. wako easy unajua there are some guys wako so serious mm ama yani unaona hata ile interaction kidogo haiko bro mm. eh but mm. unapiga job amazing sana bro thank you Nico. Yeah? thank you so maybe unaweza kuambia bro mm. ni vitu gani zenye unaweza sema why should people visit my gym mm. fitness bro eh, kama kuna mtu mwenye ako hii area ya kitusuru mm. why is it very important mm. wakama hapa hivi bro in terms of maybe location mm. the services bro the community mm. ni vitu gani zenye unaweza guzia Mm. zenye mtu mwenye ako nyumbani pale amekuwa manzi akisema nitaanza mazoezi mm. but every time ana postpone new year resolution sasa hii january shaisha <laughs> january shaisha sasa hii tuko match, yeah, yeah. Tuko match bro yeah. bado mtu anasema acha nione vile kutakuwa <laughs> mtu kama huyo Hamson yeah. unamwambiaje so mtu kama wewe uko pale home yeah unataka kuanza your, your journey about fitness yeah so karibu sana we'll tell you what to do yeah uh, concerning your journey about fitness yeah So kama uko area za Kitusuru it doesn't matter the distance. Yeah. So ni wewe kujileta kweli. Distance doesn't matter. Yeah. So it's it's about your health. Yeah. So hata kama unaishi Westlands, yeah. unaishi Wangige, yeah. you can visit my gym fitness yeah. total petrol session. Yeah. We'll tell you what to do concerning yeah. your fitness journey yeah. and tutasaidiana kabisa kweli. Yeah, that is. A uh, nice one bro Manze. I'm so not going to your time. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time bro. Thank you. you are doing an amazing job. Thank you. You have a very nice space. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so thank you so much for your time guys. Yeah. Bila nimewaambia Manze sahi tuna encourage watu waanze kufanya mazoezi more of fitness yeah health mm. health ndo tuna push sana yeah. at some point in your life whether you like it or not yes. ta kulazimu ingie kwa gym okay? yep. yeah mm. uh, so take your initiative uanze mapema mm. uh, usijiumize ya usingoje daktari ya kuambia uingie ufanye mazoezi sure. yeah mm. uh, and that's why nawaambia kama by any chance unafanya job area kitusuru na environment zake ama unaishi huku mm. yeah uh, kuna hiyo gym my gym fitness iko area total petrol station mm-hmm. yeah it's a very nice place wako na community poa sana hapa mm-hmm. they have the best uh, coaches hapa kama Hamston mwenyewe yes. so make a point manze take your initiative we kuja swali so, yote unaweza kuwa nayo whether ni story ya nutrition whether ni story ya training sure. anything to do with health and fitness mm-hmm. i can guarantee you manze utasaidika yeah? uh, so guys i'll see you on the next one uh, cheers and remember health is well kabisa thank you nice uh.